I'm at work right now and I have a migraine and my hair needs to be washed. But I got a box that I would feel remiss if I didn't share. I don't know what leads to this happening. Maybe it's nighttime and I'm feeling like a snack, something. But, oh, maybe I'm on large reseller that we don't really like to support and they were like, hey, remember this time you bought that? Maybe you'd wanna buy that again. And you're like, yeah, I wanna buy that again. So then you go directly to the company instead. And you buy. beef jerky uh so this is maybe my favorite so far by people's choice they're a small company and they're based out of socal this is in southern california and not socal uh and then they have beef sticks who doesn't like a good beef stick this is that flavor what does that say? Sea salt and pepper. And then, look at how that one's bent over. This is sweet teriyaki. I got, you guys don't even understand. I'm like smashing mouse buttons unintentionally. And then what do we have? Then I bought, oh, a small pack of original flavor. What does original taste like? Probably the same, but not spicy. Then I got Tasting Kitchen. Garlic Ginger. I think I had this one before. And I don't remember it. Must have liked it. Here's another one. It says Cowboy Pepper. I don't know, maybe that means big pieces of pepper. And then we got this one that says, sweet chili habanero. I'm excited about that. I'm hoping it's not too hot. And into the box. I got some carne seca. I believe that means dry meat. Hatch green chili. This one's gluten free. I'm thinking what I should do is send a bunch to my brother and his wife because she can't have gluten, but she can have beef. So anyway, the moral of the story is I think I'm about to eat a cow. And May someone love you as much as I love this beef jerky.